Hi there, angels. Um, I decided to go to a store that I had never been to before, and it was called BB's or DD's Discounts. Um, it's in Anaheim. I'll look and see if they have a website. If they do, I'll put it below. But so uh, they had something that caught my eye, and I've been watching a lot of mystery unboxings uh, from uh, Marie Cisnero Toth's channel. I'll put her link below as well. And it inspired me to purchase this and bring it on here and unbox it with you guys because I don't know why not something different. This is a, a mystery toy called Lost Kittens. I got this at that store at uh, DD's Discount. So, like I said, I'll see if I can find a link. But let me show you. Oh, what the packaging yeah, is looking like. Let me show you each one of the sides so you can see. And there's the front. So, uh, I don't know what to expect. <laughs> it says, who's hidden inside? Lost kittens. Well, they won't be lost once I open this up. I'm just gonna open it like <laughs> like a carton of milk and first thing I see is that little fella right there. That's cute. We're just gonna open it like that and I'm already seeing a little something. Okay, I'm guessing this is like their guide of some of their <clears throat> little Critters. Yeah, I think that's what this is. Looks like there's some cuties. Oh, I'm so blind, I don't think I'll be able to read the names of them though. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and open the other side as well. Oh, and on this side, there's another little guy right there. There's this guy on this side. This guy on that side. <clears> okay. <throat> hey. That's what I'm seeing when I look in the top. Let me just. Actually, I'm confused. <laughs> We're going to just keep diving in and see what else. Okay. A little cardboard piece of paper. Feeling something paper or plastic bag wise. Okay, this says Lost Kitties. Lost Kitties. And a very colorful bag. Not sure. Okay, so this is an empty bag. I guess you can. Keep your lost kitty in the bag? I don't know, it sounds peculiar to me. Here's what I'm pulling out right here. Oh my, uh, I'm completely confused. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm looking at. I, I, I don't know, I just, it's cute. <laughs> Lost kitties. Some kind of pink stuff. I'm thinking this might be like a frosting or candy or I don't I'm confused. And the writing is way too smart for me to open. And here's another one of those. Maybe it's clay, like Play-Doh? You're supposed to maybe make them? Mm, confused, I don't know. Another little piece of cardboard. Looks like another. One of these, this is a disparate color, I don't know. I really am confused. I think this is clay. I think this is clay, molding clay. And I 
think this is clay. Because that would explain the bag. So then it keeps it from drying out. Open here. Oh, I didn't open where it told me to open. Whoops. But had I not opened, I wouldn't have seen the cute little characters on these sides, so. Oh, I guess I still could have seen them. Oh well, it doesn't matter. my magnifier is <laughs> um Kitty from Sparkle Squad inside maybe maybe these are like the I, I don't even know what to think Okay, we're gonna go ahead and open one of these up. I'm scared and nervous. We're gonna open the this really big one. Okay, it had a design and type type didn't smash it. I think this is like modeling play maybe? I don't know. Oh wait, there's something going on underneath. I'm confused, I don't know what's happening. Hold on, let's see. <gasps> okay, 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 we got something going on here. <laughs> this is the weirdest thing I've ever experienced before. I, I think it's modeling clay. Looks like I've got a couple stickers here underneath the clay. So there's a kitty playing with a ball of yarn. If I can show you, hold on. Ah, oh, sorry, I don't wanna get that stuff on my screen, so. But yes, a couple of stickers. Okay, we've got some stuff here. I don't know what this stuff is. Got some. I don't know what this is. I think these are like accessories. I'm very confused. My battery's getting low. I'm going to have to switch it out. This one is like stuck in the clay. Hmm. I guess it's clay or putty or... I, I don't know. If you have ever seen these and know exactly what the stuff is, well, let me know in the comment section. I'm guessing this would dry out if I left it out. So we're gonna focus on opening these little things to see what is in those. Good, I have scissors close by. So I'm not looking to fight with this thing. Okay. Okay, so we have little monster guy right here. You. And he sits up straight, so that's cool. And it looks like he has a little kitty friend. She's got the ball of yarn. Kitty with the ball of yarn. Cuteness. Now, obviously, that one's not going to sit up straight. I'm not sure, like, what the situation is with this. Like, what? I'm just, I'm not sure. I'm really not sure what what happens with this. If you're supposed to build something with this, like, I don't know. 
I know that it got stuck in this accessory here, but that's okay. We're just gonna set that aside. And we're gonna put this clay into the bag to keep it nice and fresh. I'm like, a, again, putty, clay, whatever. I'm not even sure 100% what we're dealing with here. <laughs> All right, let me take the stickers out. Okay, so maybe underneath each thing of clay, there's a critter or... No, each, the rest of them, I think, is just clay. We're going to pull one... We're going to pull the brown one out and see. Just to be sure, because... I've never gotten this set before, so... No, we do have a, another one right here. Okay. And another sticker under the clay. Weird place to put that stuff. Okay, this is a, a cute little striped kitty right there. Mmm, striped kitty is not focusing. There we go. Sorry about that. And... Okay, then it looks like the accessory for this one is a little dumbbell. Cute. Cute, cute. Okay, so we've got our clay right here. We're going to go ahead and put that in our sealed bag. Keep it fresh. I don't really care if it sits next to the other color if they wind up blending a little bit it's not going to be the end of the world okay this oh it's a little fat kitty cat that is so lucy come here lucy come here come here fireworks are going off I'm setting the Chihuahua. All right, let's see what the pink one is going to provide. Hi, Chihuahua. You hearing those fireworks? Yeah, yeah. Okay, it's a very bright color of pink. I'm pushing at the back, and that's really helping these ooch out. The sticker is, what is the sticker of? Okay, it looks like a little wizard. I, don't, I know there's a glare. I'm sorry. The stickers are something. Let's see. It looks like a book is the accessory. That's cute. We got the pink clay right here. We'll go ahead and put that in our bag. Our bag of clay. And then we've got our little package right here this is really a lot like they've got clay to play with they've got the little toys all very cute the little wizard guy right here let's see if we can get it to focus there we go cute little fella oh he sits up as well okay now we've got this one with speckles in it that had the little cover. My battery is going to probably die before I have a chance to finish this. So I may have to put these two parts together if that winds up being the case. So if I abruptly cut away, that would be why. Okay, this one has a sticker that says, you gotta be kitten me. <laughs> the little kitten on it, you've gotta be kitten me. That's cute. Very cute. This has two accessories in it. Some of them have had one, this one has two. Looks like a camera and not sure what this is supposed to be. Maybe a a bowl or something. I really couldn't begin to tell you what that's supposed to be. But the clay here has got like little specks of color in it. 
and we're gonna go ahead and put that right there and then we also have this which I'm not sure what is so different about this that they separate it into these tiny little pouches but I'm gonna open one and see if there's anything inside oh forgot to open this sorry about that let's go ahead and get this little guy open oh wow oh he's special it's like a little sparkly one supposed to be a cat I think because the tail but it almost looks like a frog okay I'm back I, I had it upside down it actually is a kitten with its little paws covering its little eyes I don't know if you guys can see that and unfortunately it doesn't sit up it falls over but it's very sparkly and cute you can always lean it against something. Alright, let's get into these little weird pack and see what's going on in these. If I can pull the plastic away from the bottom part. There we go. Okay, still smells like Play-Doh, so we're still working with the same materials here. Wow, it's not letting me push at the bottom though to, to get it out. Uh, all right yeah it looks like why did they put stuff in the bottom I don't understand <laughs> looks like there's accessor an accessory in the bottom so you've got your little thing of clay okay so here's a pillow a little pillow accessory for sleepy kitty then you have another little bit of clay here to work with. So I'm guessing each one of these has an accessory at the bottom. Huh. Interesting, interesting. I hate that you can't push it from the bottom to get the clay out because I got long nails and it's a little bit of a pain. I mean, it's not the worst thing that's ever happened to me, but. It's be really difficult for kids because their little fingers, well, maybe the little fingers would be able to get in there and get that out better than mine just because. That adult size hand, okay, I don't. Oh, a little microphone. Hey, Paula. All right, so. I guess it would be hey hey Paula, but I don't want to get copywritten, so hey Paula. Who's Paula? I don't know. The person they were singing about at the time, I guess. I keep wanting to just push this out at the bottom, but I know that's not going to happen, so let's just dig into the side and oops. I feel the accessory. Such an interesting way to, to do that. Ah, I'm dropping stuff on the floor. Okay, here we go. What do we got going on here? Banana, banana, banana. Blue banana. For your potassium needs. Blue bananas. My taste a bit funny. Come up here, Papa, if you want. Alright. Last one. <laughs> All right. Can't tell exactly what this is. It's got clay all over it. 
It's just a disc with bumps, so maybe it's supposed to be like a cookie with like chocolate chips in it or something. Maybe. Ah. Your guess is as good as mine with what this is supposed to be. But we have a whole nother thing of clay here, so cool beans. And then I'm guessing that you're supposed to take inspiration from the things here on the paper to create your own very very own lost kitty mm -hmm. but yeah actually i actually think this is a pretty cool toy um or kit or whatever you want to call it really because you have two elements you've well three elements actually you have the stickers you have the clay and then you also have the cute little figurines and all of the accessories that come with those little figurines so this was five dollars and 99 cents i do think that it is worth six dollars or five dollars and 99 cents i would recommend it to others because uh if you have kids this is certainly something that will keep them busy and it'll be fun for them to open everything up and pull everything out and have the stickers to play with or trade or whatever they want to do and if they're collectible type of kids you know they had multiple ones of these at the store so you could potentially buy you know um enough to form a decent sized collection these little guys are super cute super super cute uh, let me know what you thought in the comment section below of this Lost Kitties kit. Um, if it's something that you think that kids that you know uh, would enjoy. If you were a child or maybe you are a child, is this something that you would have enjoyed as a child? I would have loved this as a child. I was all about stickers and tiny little toys and I love playing with clay. I didn't get to do it very often because it was messy so it wasn't really something encouraged in my home <laughs> but I would have been really really happy to uh, to receive this. It looks like this is for ages five and up so kindergarten age around. Um, so yeah I think that's uh, I think that's a pretty good pretty good purchase thank you so much for watching i do appreciate it and like i said before let me know in the comment section below if this would have been a toy that you would have enjoyed as a child or if this is something that children that you know um would enjoy that my niece and nephew when they were young i think that they would have enjoyed this i think that i had fun opening up the mystery little packets and then of course you have the nice clay to play with and stickers are always fun for kids to uh to enjoy or to give to their friends or stick on their belongings or whatever and so yeah thank you so much for watching and don't forget to thumbs this up i'll see you in the next one bye bye